I hope the the mood around here is is very good. Yes, absolutely. We're very happy with the the start of the tournament. Um, now we have Arg Argentina left, but we are um, already through. So that's of course a mentally relief, but we still want to win. Uh, it's a, a question I do a lot these days. How important is um, being first of the group, being second? I don't know if it's a bit overvalued or is it really important for you, for your confidence, for the players? Uh, it's hard to know from the from the start because you never know who you're going to meet. But um, we always want to be first. So that's what we're aiming for. Uh, there are some cases that, uh, as you said, you don't know if it's better to be first or second because of the of the next opponent. So um, I guess uh, most players will will say, um, I don't care. I just want to be first and and come what may, right? Yeah, it is like that. And at the end of the the day, you want to win the gold, and then you have to win against everyone uh, anyway. So it doesn't really matter. And the team has been a bit in, in crescendo, no? It was the first game in the first half was uh, difficult, second half was better, the second game yeah, started uh, very well and, and a very good result, so uh, I guess that's the, the best confidence bump you, you can have, no? Uh, seeing that the team is growing. Mm, yeah. Uh, sometimes group stages can be tricky and uh, it's just about getting the points in and uh, we've done the work, we've, uh, we've won too and uh, we're very happy about that and just surviving the group stage <laughs> is, is important and so now um, we have to, to really perform in the, in the finals. Plus, the, the team has some a wide range of, of resources because uh, we've seen the team managing the ball well, but we've seen set pieces in the last game as well uh, being good. So there's uh, lots of resources to take to take uh, when uh, things go wrong. Yeah, exactly. Uh, we always have that to to lean back on, uh, which is uh, a weapon we have uh, that we work on uh, a lot. And we have really good uh, servers and uh, really good headers in there. So. Um, we uh, we always have that uh, if the, the the game is not going our way. The rest of the World Cup, uh, I'm sure you you have been uh, watching. Uh, what the, did you uh, did make you uh, clap or uh, or get up uh, from the from the sofa? Uh, a lot of things, but uh, most recently I would say Colombia yesterday against Germany. Well, that was a big surprise to me. I haven't seen Colombia before, so that was amazing. Uh, the technique the girls had and and uh, the willing to win against a big team like Germany it was um, amazing to see. And the goals that they scored, uh, yeah. So this uh, World Cup uh, is uh, full of surprises. I guess it's uh, by one part scary, but another, but another part is is uh, to make you proud, no? To to discover one new team that you didn't know and yeah. hey, they play well. Yeah, yeah, it's it's a bit scary. Uh, as I said, you like you never know like who, who you're gonna play in the in the finals, but um, uh, yeah, it can be anyone, and it's gonna be a tough game now. That's how far we've come with women's football. How that, that's how good we've devel developed. So. Uh, it's amazing to see how fast it's uh, grown. Thank you. Nice. Thank you. Apart from from your team. Uh, yeah, I watched probably all the games, um, but I would say that Colombia, uh, I think, is really good, uh, and I didn't expect them to be that good. It said, I don't know if it's make you proud or it's a bit scary as well as a competitor to discover one team like you may have not seen a lot of of them and and yeah. they are very good. Yeah, I mean, I think it's just fun and good that like the lower teams have been performing well and are doing better. Uh, so I think it's more even games and I think it's just good for the competition. Uh, how was the mood in, in the camp? I guess it's very good. Uh, you have uh, uh, two victories and, and, uh, and you have the classification. So. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it feels nice to know that we are through to the to the next uh, stage, uh, so we have a really good feeling in the team. Um, I guess, uh, as you said, the lower teams are getting better. Yeah. Um, uh, there has been several um, surprises, even uh, you, the US had a, a draw, it was not a bad thing, obviously. Yeah. Bad, but so uh, I guess, uh, except you, you by now are not having that uh, kind of difficulties because you, you won the two games and you are uh, like right now um, out of any trouble. Yeah, 
yeah, I know. I like it feels good to be through, and of course we want to be first in the group, so we want to win the last game as well. How important is being first once you you know you are you are going out of the group? How important is for you just to be first for a confidence bump for I don't know why? Yeah, no, it feels good, and of course it's important to have a good feeling when you go to the next stage. Uh, so yeah, it's important to have a good feeling in the team. Mm -hmm. um, we, you have shown as a team uh, very good uh, managing of the ball, but as well you have a, a, a threat in the set pieces. So looks like you have a wide array of resources. If, if when a, a game gets difficult, you have several ways of, of getting out of the problems. Yeah, and I think that's our strength that we have many different good strengths so I think it will be important when we are competing in the next games. And uh, um, uh, when you see uh, the future of the possible rivals, uh, what are the ones that uh, surprise you most apart from Colombia or, or do you fear most, I don't know? Oh, yeah. I don't know, I think that Japan has been good uh, but also of course I think Spain is good, Holland like the Netherlands are really good and yeah there are so many good teams so it will be tough. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you.